Hello and welcome to the Aegis iCoach video tutorial. The Aegis iCoach app is your portal to a variety of effective resources and tools to help you achieve your leadership and learning goals. Aegis Learning is dedicated to your success. In this app, you will have access to many tools, almost all are free, including program materials, a discussion forum, learning resources, inspirations, videos, and articles. This video tutorial will provide instructions and information on how to download the app, how to navigate the app, and the various features within the app. So let's get started iCoach is available to both Android and iOS users. If you are an Android user, access the Google Play Store. If you are an iOS user, visit the iTunes App Store to download the app. Click on the icon to open your store. When you are in your App Store, click on the spyglass icon to open up the search feature. Enter Aegis, A-E-G-I-S, iCoach in the search bar and click. There is sometimes an ad at the top of the search results, so look for the Aegis iCoach screenshots and title before downloading. To the right of the Aegis iCoach title, you will see a cloud with an arrow or a button to download the app. Click it to begin downloading. You should see a circle with a square in the middle or something indicating that the app is downloading. Please note that the app is free, but based on your app store settings, you may still need to verify with your pin number or thumbprint to authorize the download. Once the Aegis iCoach is successfully downloaded on your device, you can click on the open button or you can kick, click on the home button to open the app. Once the app is successfully downloaded on your device, you will see a open button next to the app. You can either hit that button or push your home screen and you will see the iCoach app icon on your screen. It is a white square with the gold Aegis shield in the middle and Aegis iCoach underneath. You can long press the app button and drag it to position the icon and app on your home screen if you wish. Click on the iCoach icon to open the app. The first time you open the app, it will ask you a few questions. The first question it's going to ask you is allow Aegis iCoach to access your location. There are three different choices there and it's all based on personal preference. I personally always allow the app to access my location, but the app will work just fine with any three, one of these three selections. The next question the app will ask you is if you would like to enable push notifications from Aegis. If you select yes, you may periodically receive updates and messages via the app. Again, this is personal preference. I am going to select notify me. After you have indicated whether or not you would like to receive push notifications, on the bottom of the screen you will see a scrolling yellow ticker tape. If you click this area, you will be directed to a variety of valuable Aegis leadership and business articles. To go back to the home screen, click the back button in the upper left hand corner, the, the small arrow. In the upper right of the home screen, you will see a gear. This is the app settings button. We'll talk more about this later. Next to the settings button or the gear, there is an envelope. This is an updates area. If you have enabled push notifications, this is where you will receive leadership updates, information, 
and push messages from Aegis. The final navigation area on the iCoach home screen is the menu area in the upper left of the screen. There are three or four small lines next to the word menu. When you click the menu button or the small lines, you will open the slider of iCoach features. And we'll talk a little bit more in depth about these in a moment. To close the slider, Simply, simply click on the home screen of the app. Let's go back to the features. Click on the menu or the three small lines. There are 12 features within the iCoach app. The program materials feature contains the first five program guides in PDF format from the 10 competencies of leadership. You have the option of printing or downloading each program guide for later use. By clicking on the small print button in the upper right or one of the items in the toolbar down below or the download button, the blue download button at the bottom of the screen. In the program materials area, we also have participant forms, including the learning reinforcement worksheet, reading report, and program evaluation. Once you complete a form, it can be electronically submitted to Aegis by clicking the blue submit button at the bottom of the form. Let's go back to the features. The discussion board feature is an open forum for leadership questions or discussions. Right now the discussion board is empty because the app has just been launched, but in the future this will be an opportunity for students to interact with each other and with the Aegis learning team. Going back to the features, the learning resources area provides access to the leading edge newsletter leadership videos, and leadership and business articles. Again, you have the option to print these articles from the upper right hand little print icon in the yellow part of the screen. Going back to the slider bar of features, the inspirations feature provides leadership-driven quotes to help motivate and inspire. The tools feature provides access to paid content, such as books and disc assessments. If you are interested in purchasing these, you can click on that feature to learn more information and to purchase a book or a disc assessment. The calendar feature outlines open enrollment dates information and provides links for you to register for open classes. Blogs and articles provides free leadership and business insights and information from the Aegis team of professionals. The Aegis Cares feature provides information on how Aegis is focused on making a difference in lives, our community, and the world in which we live. Click this feature to find out how you can get involved. The Aegis Team feature provides pictures, bios, and contact information for each of our team members.
About Aegis Learning provides a company overview, contact information, and access to the Aegis Learning website. And finally, the social media feature provides links to the Aegis Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram accounts. Let's talk a little bit more about the settings area of the app on the home screen. If you remember, the settings area is the gear button in the upper right hand corner. If you hit the settings button, the settings contains a profile area that allows you the ability to set up a personal profile with a picture, name, email, and birthday information. The settings area also provides the ability to connect your social media accounts to the app and provides information on the Aegis privacy policy. And please know that when you provide your information or you link accounts, this information always stays with Aegis and is never shared with a third party. For further questions or help with the app, you can access the Aegis iCoach uh, manual on the Aegis website, or you can email Polly Walker at polly at discoveragis.com. We welcome and value your feedback. Please let us know what you like about the app or what we can improve. Are there any features you would like to see that we haven't included? Any features that you loved? Let us know. You can email Tim Schneider at tim at discoverages.com. And also, we would really appreciate it if you would leave us a rating and your feedback in the iTunes or Google Play Store. We are very, very excited to offer the new Ages iCoach app to you, and we hope you enjoy it.